Good afternoon, my crafty friends. This is Debbie with Your and Market. And today is um, going to be a couple pages of my personal journal. And this was um, today's uh, one of the pages I'm going to do. My uh, youngest grandson. Uh, this was uh, July 6th. Kind of celebrated maybe a little bit late. He was having fun there with the flag and his toys. So yeah, um, I'm going to have to move these paper clips out of the way though. And then I had this piece of uh, stationery for a long time. Well, got kind of a little pack of it. The uh, flag, the United States flag. Hopefully those papers underneath don't go... Oh, I know what I was clipping down. I was clipping down the uh, calendar page. I'm going to actually um, glue in also. And then this is just a piece of vellum that just, you know, I'm not we're probably going to decorate it. So let's see here. I think I'm going to use both. I think I'm going to use the glue stick and then the liquid glue also. Okay, I think I'm going to set that aside though. I don't want glue on that yet. And then this is just the flip out from Father's Day. Oh, and then I did find this. I might put on the edge. Might be a little bit hard to do that on this page, but I could put it on here. We'll see. Okay, let's get the glue on first. This is just the uh, permanent glue stick. This is a little bit uh, cardstock, so just a little bit of decorating. I have some of the pages ready to go, just I was just going through and seeing what I had available. So yeah, we're going to go ahead and do the art gl glitter glue around the edges of this. Just because it's, um, I think it'll stick a little bit better. So I'm hoping that you guys are enjoying this. Like I said, um don't do like a, I, I just try to find things that go with the theme of the day, whatever the event was. So it's like I said, my little, my youngest grandchild there playing with the flag. Yeah, it's, um, it's too hot for me to go and sit out in the, uh, <laughs> watch fireworks. Just the older I get, it's like, ugh, hot. Can't do it anymore. Might be a little bit bigger. I think I'm going to drag it down to the bottom. Let's see here. It's right on the edge. I might have to trim that up, though. I don't know if that's going to actually... Okay, it seems to go open. Yeah, that might need to be trimmed up a little bit, though. Or don't mind that. That's just the back side. <laughs> I was using that for something. Okay, there we go. Um, I'm not sure. This is, um, this I think is supposed to be like a bracelet or something. I don't know what that's going to look like on the other side. Yeah, when you put glue on the vellum, though, you can actually see it, so... I could, I could just do a little uh, tab or something out of it. And then I thought, because um, I knew there'd be an extra space, so I think I'll just use these uh, tickets up here and then get the photo on. That's pretty much going to be it for this one. I mean, I'll probably go back and get a label and just, you know, put his name and the date and everything just so we know, we remember, you know, how old he is. That's pretty much it for that one. I just ripped that off just <laughs> crazy so we can uh, get going with it. I'm looking for a piece of cardboard or something. Here we go. Just so I can get the glue stick on this. Hope the light's okay, you guys. Um, uh, with the uh, weather change and everything. It's getting um, 
kind of cloudy today, is what I'm trying to say. There, make sure that's not okay. I might need to turn that up just a little. Oh, yeah, it's kind of hanging out over there. I'll wait for that to dry all the way, though. Like I said, I just wanted the page all the way covered up. And then this is, um, let's see, this photo I use, it's called Pick Frame, and then just, you know, made it a 4 by 6 and so it doubled up. Let's see, where can we put the label? Do we put the label below? Well, I kind of like it up there a little bit. Yeah, and then look, then this I can write. I don't even need a label. I can just write on there what that says. I'll just use a liquid glue. Oops, on the photo. I try not to get glue all over myself. Yeah, some people, I watch them, and I, I think it's so awesome. They paint, you know, in the background, these little scenes and stuff. And I'm just like, hmm, yeah, okay. <laughs> I think I need to take a painting class. Not, I haven't really ever painted anything. I kind of like that covering up just a little bit up there. I could add, like, I can add more on here, like some um, washi tape or something like that to bring in some color. Hopefully I'm not going around too much. But yeah, I'll, um, and my, oh gosh, that was the glue. Oh no. Okay, we'll wait for that to dry and then I have an eraser I can wipe that off with, I think. Yeah, they have they make those erasers for glue, and since this is a shiny surface, it shouldn't be a problem. But you could actually, you know, you could use like a a marker, Posca pen, or something like that. What if I use the red one, or maybe the blue. I think we'll use blue. I'm not sure what. Oh, I have used it before. So these you have to shake up. As I see these over here, I can decorate this a little bit more. And I just want to see if, um, let's see. I don't know why I never seem to have paper over here, just scratch paper. <laughs> okay, this is like the glue side, so once that dries, it would be okay. There we go, yeah. Okay, and I know I did this before, but you kind of make it like a doodle around photos. And images instead of trying to be you know precise because um, I don't know about you but the more perfect I try to make it the worse I think it becomes so I'll just turn this around it'll just be easier for me to um, go around like this so, the fuzz there and hopefully I don't hit the photo too bad I bought these Posca pins for this reason, and then I forget to use them. Yep, I'll just keep turning this around. Oops, I just covered it up. <laughs> there we go. Like I said, this is just my way of kind of adding like a personal touch to it. Sorry, you guys, my arm has to be in the way there. I'll get this back around the other way. Here. Okay. There we go. I should put probably like a sentiment on here. That would be good. I'm kind of just thinking of this as I'm doing it. I it's I don't like how my process goes. I mean, I get the basic elements, but then it's like, oh, yeah, I could do this. Actually, I have the little papers I saved, too. Let's see if I get this out without... Sometimes I pull on things and other things come out. These little papers down here, 
I've been saving these little pieces. Like here's blue polka dots. Oh, I actually kind of like the blue. We probably don't need that big of a piece though. Well, let's see. Let's check at the sentiment. Yeah, the sentiment probably should be white. It's not that black. It's going to kind of show up as well. Start doing things you love. Let's see. I kind of like there is beauty and simplicity. Let's see. Best day ever. Use your wings. Remember the now. Practice kindness. All you need is love. I think I kind of like this one for the for my youngest grandson. Where'd it go? What was it again? Simplicity. There's beauty in simplicity. How? I think that's just simple. He's playing with his toys. Having a really good time there. You know, I kind of like that just at the bottom there and just not even cut that off. Not bad if I'm making any extra racket over there. Let's see here. Yeah, I think I'm going to make it, I'm just going to scooch that up right there. See, that's probably still wet. I did lean the paper over here. That's why I'm kind of struggling. Let me make sure. <laughs> we'll just get some, um, we could just get the glue stick on this. As long as we get the edges really good. And you can see that it's wet. With the darker paper. There we go. Now, you guys, if you have any um, helpful tips for, you know, decorating, just let me know. I'm gonna put it on there. Lock it on. There we go. Kind of cover up their little logo too of that pick frame. I don't think of something to write on, um, you know, about the day. Just like, I love this age, this toddler age. It's, it's a hard age, but it's a fun age. <laughs> but yeah, there we go. Another little day done. Okay, so this page, I'm actually, what I'm doing is um, I'm going in the calendar. This is uh, July, just with the uh, little events and things like that on there. This one's going to need some glue. <laughs> so just so it's in there, but then it created another page for me on the back side. So, um, yeah, I'm hoping I can get the rest of the year in here. Not sure. Oh, I'll put glue all over this. Uh, this is actually a book page there. And we'll go in with some uh, liquid glue. Also, the glitter glue that I like to use. Get those edges down. Yeah, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with that um, USA bracelet. Stick the pages together. I like how it, my daughter actually got me this uh, calendar pad. It's a uh, blank. You now where you can just write in your own date and month and everything. I really like it. I just like having things written down. That way you can go back and look it up. Now 
if that's not enough, we can I can go in and um, pick that up. And see, I just I don't know this little cell phone, not cell phone. I even completely forgot the word. It's just this is funny when you glue on it, you can see the glue. Now, if you have double sided tape, that does work a lot better. Um, I don't know if that would hold that on. This is this is kind of thick, so I may not use that. I have some pieces we can clip off. I'll have to turn this. Cut that off. Oh, wait. Do I want to cut that off? What is that? Wait, no, I think I'm going to use the exacto knife on that. Or the box cutter. Well, you know what? I'm just going to leave it. I'm, I'm going to be cutting into stuff. I'm not sure. I'm going to do that. Nope, reset. We're not doing that. Okay. Let's see. I think we can do another page. Now this page over here, um, there's no photos. I just did a photo of the um, minions that I took my uh, grandkids to see. This will be on the back side of the calendar. Mm, excuse me. Oh yeah, this is, uh, let's see, I think I'm going to put the, the under. And I did, again, I just got some more of these. These are from Dollar Tree. They were just, you know, something to decorate with. I'm going to have to put the receipt here. It's going to be covered up a little bit. Just, you know, I have it, so I'm just going to put it on there. I should have two of them. I don't know where the other one went. But I did go on two different days. So do you guys keep receipts and other kinds of um, ephemera that might be, you know, maybe should be thrown away? <laughs> It's just, you know, this too, this, because this is on that thermal paper, it'll fade over time. It just gives another texture underneath. You see, I got to check the camera. And I know this book is so big. So yeah, this is just, um, you know, record, uh, remembering the day. Um... I might go through and try to find maybe just some random photos of my kid, my grandkids. This has the date on it more than anything, so yeah, I think that's a good spot. Well, I could make that a flip, but I don't think I want to. I'm just gonna glue it down. Again, you guys, this is actually on photo paper, so <laughs> yeah, I gotta use this liquid glue oh got clogged already i have had the lid off so it probably just got clogged up this dries out super super quick even when i'm trying to use it you know i'm trying to get those edges it's white on white guys i'm not sure <laughs> how much of it you can see Maybe we'll do it. I'll just do it there. Pick a spot. Pick a spot. <laughs> Don't think about it. Just pick a spot. Yeah, see, something like this, I might, like I said, just come back and add some more photos later. I don't know. I'm just recording the day, is all I'm doing. And a lot of my days are of my grandkids, as you can tell. 
I was thinking about maybe even doing, um, I gotta get some photos of my dog, but I could do like a couple of pages of her, you know? Do you guys do your pets? Or maybe even have a pet journal. That would be fun. I only have one pet though. <laughs> could find maybe some older photos of her. Let's see. Maybe at the top again. It's just fun little thing to put on there. And then this is a birthday, as you can see over here. Was that another receipt? Oh. Yeah, but that was something different. <laughs> Papers flying everywhere. Let's see here. I wanna here. I'm gonna do it on the back of this page. I just don't wanna get the photo glue all over it. So yeah, these uh, tickets are just something fun to put on there. Up to just kind of you can kind of use it as a washi tape. Just um. Well, we don't really even have tickets anymore when we go to the movies. It's all... <laughs> you just scan it in your phone. That QR code. So, a different... Just something different. Oh, it's almost... You know, I think I'm just going to fold that right on over. Don't worry about cutting it off. It's just the calendar. I don't really think it's going to hurt anything. That's a little bit lopsided, but that's okay. And then you can um, always put some, maybe some tape on here. Washi tape. Oh, we have hearts. Hearts. Kind of. That just ripped. I wonder if I can get another piece too. yeah right now i'm just adding just this page is um kind of plain but like i said i can always go back and add more where is the i think this was a really inexpensive tape some of these tapes i bought they don't seem to they shred when you try to pull it off. Let's see if I can salvage this. <laughs> wow. No. If I can get another piece, I'll just go over the top of it. <laughs> Wait, I tell you, sometimes it's a struggle. I'm trying to show you stuff and then this happens. <laughs> Am I going the wrong way? Could be going the wrong way. Okay. Hard to see. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're just gonna just do something else. That's wild. Let's see. What do we have here? You know, I have all this Halloween tape over here. I forgot to bring over some other tape. I don't like this one. Hmm. Okay, guys. Let's see if I can just get a chunk of it off. Oh my goodness, that was too big of a chunk. <laughs> wow. Well, I really made a mess of that, so maybe that wasn't a good idea. <laughs> hmm. This just doesn't want to come apart for some reason. And it just did the same thing. Okay, you guys. That is just annoying. Okay, we're just going to leave it there. And maybe I can fix it up later. Okay, I think we'll do another page. Um, these don't take that long. This one 
and um, this is birthday. Um, he turned seven. So you guys, I don't know if you recognize this. This is from the August um, mixed media journal that uh, Shannon with Shinuki Art I participated in, and um, yeah, um, I almost forgot about these. I wanted to like, just like you know use them in my journal. Kind of like uh, pre-made little backgrounds. I need to move this out of the way. It's just um, the photo will cover it up. And I kind of like it. It says, attitude is everything. So I kind of want to put that in an area where we can see the photos. I'll just um, get that glued on there. Oh, I got some more paper clips. Move the paper clips. Yeah, I'm just going to um, glue this on. It might hang over a little bit. I want to keep that in mind. And this is pretty thick, so um, the page is pretty thick from the mixed media. Oh, that's the side. Oh, that doesn't want to hang over. <laughs> I feel like that. I kind of want to just leave a little bit of space there so it doesn't, you know, touch the other page. And this was just a, um, something I purchased the paper. It was just like a, um, what are those called? Like a day planner type. Uh, journal. You see all the days of the week and stuff on it, but it kind of worked. It worked out for this because it's a little bit heavier for the, all that mixed media that I did. So I will link the um, the playlist below. You guys can, if you haven't seen it before, you can go and look at it. Oh yeah. I want it in the center, and then I might put some tape on it. It is hanging over a little bit, but I don't mind at all. I mean, I can always put, um, I can cover that up with tape or something. Oh, yeah, I'm just giving it a good press down right now. I thought, you know, I made all of those. All of a sudden, I go, oh, yeah, I made all of that stuff. This is just, I stamped on a piece of uh, the vellum. Let's see here. I'm going to put him about there. Or maybe over here. Or maybe I'll put him over here. Cover up that area where I just took off the, <laughs> the little sentiment there. Yeah, he's uh, seven years old. And, um... He's wearing what I got him. He's He loves soccer and he loves watching the professional soccer. So I'm not familiar with all the names, but I think Messi's the one that, but even this guy, I guess, um, Ronaldo, is his name. I guess he's a really good um, soccer player also. But yeah, my, um, look at my little lots of paint are kind of they're framing that pretty good oh so yeah i was like really glad i remembered i had this <laughs> i probably need some tape on it definitely And this is, I know, this tape seems to be a little bit better. And it, does, it doesn't bother me putting the tape on, except I don't leave room there to put the tape on. I'm going to have to, um, hopefully this works. Get that in there. This is um, in between signatures. There's just space in there. Okay. Oh, yeah, I did. It hit it just perfect. Great. That piece worked a lot better. <laughs> and let's 
see if I can get this folded over. Okay, you guys, I think I'm going to go ahead and end it there. And then um, I'll definitely do um, some more videos. If you guys don't mind. I mean, they're all going to be different just because I don't, I don't really have a theme in my personal journal. I kind of the page is the theme, I guess. There we go. And then the vellum. Oh yeah, I'm going to tape that on. I'm going to tape that on like here. I'm going to flip over. So just, this just needs a little short piece. And then just another little short piece on, on the back side also to give it that hinge. Now we've got, we've got a little a little bit of interaction going on. And then this can go back on there too. I'll just kind of trim that up a little bit. And I'll just put it down here. Okay, I think that's it for today. Little piece that I, <laughs> my little art project there. Where was I putting this? Down below his feet there, I think so. Okay. And there we go. That flips up. And then it's all it's already I think I wrote it down in here, his birthday. But yeah, Derek's birthday. Okay. All right. And um yeah, this is already the end of July here. Um uh, just because they're always involved with other things. So um for today. That's it for today, and until next time, happy crafting. Bye-bye.